Hi planners, thanks for tuning in to my YouTube channel. It's me, Chloe from Chloe G Plans. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you my latest Erin Condren order, which was part of the Black Friday sale. So if you're a little confused, I know Black Friday hasn't happened just yet, but Erin Condren started their sale early. So I went ahead and put an order in as soon as it started. And yes, it has already been shipped to me. I've already received the order. So I wanted to go ahead and show you that. I also wanted to show you the free gift that they gave me with the order. And um, I also have some stickers that I ordered from a little um, sticker shop that I love to buy from. So I'm going to show you those as well at the end of the video. So let's get right into this and make sure you go ahead and like this video. Comment down below anything that you liked from this order or if there's anything that you ordered in the sale that you're excited about. And make sure you use my links if you decide to shop and subscribe my goal right now for youtube is 5,000 subscribers so y'all gotta help me get there i'm super excited about my growth though so far and i appreciate all of you for subscribing so let's get right into it If you are a new viewer, welcome to my channel. If you are a subscriber, welcome back. I wanna give you the full unboxing experience, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you how it looks when you first open it. So I first open the box, I get this Winter Volume 5 um, newsletter from Erin Condren. And so I've showed you all this newsletter before, but for those who haven't been on my channel just yet, when you open the newsletter on page two, boom there is Chloe Tree Plans. So make sure you go ahead and shout me out when you get your newsletter in the mail on social media. So follow me on Instagram at Chloe Tree Plans. And if you open your newsletter and you see me, make sure you go ahead and tag me on Instagram because I want you to check out all of these social medias. Make sure you also check out these lovely ladies and their um, Instagram pages. So just wanted to put that out there for you to go ahead and tag me when you get the newsletter. So that is the first thing. The next thing is when you open up the tissue paper, I wanna show you the free gift. So this is the free gift that Erin Condren decided to give, just so you can see it better and it contrasts well. I'm going to remove this box. You get this lovely blue and pink box. This is the really pretty snowflake design. They also have a cover with this really pretty design on it. And when you open it up, you get this lovely recipe card. And the recipe card, it says asterisk cookie dough recipe. Um, oh, I got a little bit ahead of myself. So also on the actual box top, it says wishing you health and happiness this season. So that is a really cute touch. I think this would make a great gift. But even if you keep it for yourself, you're able to use this little um, cookie dough recipe. And on the back, it features a note from Jody. And if you don't follow Jody, her um, Instagram handle is at Life Organized Chaos. She has a really cool little recipe here. And um, yeah, it gives you a little bit of note about her. So if you want to check out her as an EC Squad member, go ahead and check it out. And then we move on to these little labels, which I think these are such a cute little added touch. It says baked by, and you can write on this with a, like a Sharpie. And then this says baked with love by and from the kitchen of. So if you make some type of, have some type of little like plastic, you know how you like put cookies in plastic, I think it'd be really cute to have this on the outside. So this is very, cute and it moves me to really want to bake and actually give some gifts um to some friends now we have the actual cookie cutter so the cookie cutter um just did that because it's a lot easier than trying to pull it out of the paper put that back in here this is what it looks like it's pretty big i'll measure it so you can i can tell you exactly how big it seems to be here's my little ruler here so this seems to be from top to bottom or left to right or however you want to measure um it's about four inches so that's a pretty good size cookie like four by four size cookie i mean of course it's like cut so it's not exactly that but you get an idea of how big the cookie actually will be and i think this is just such a cute little idea to use this cookie cutter and have your signature erin condren cookies you can send it to a planner friend 
or anyone else who may like this. And it can also be kind of looked at as like a snowflake um, for the winter season. So that is something that I think is really cute and I am excited to get to baking and <laughs> making some treats for friends when I go on my winter break. So I'm excited for this. Just want to remind you that this was free with my purchase. I believe it's still going on if you're watching this video in real time, that this is still a part of the sale. So go ahead and use my link. When you use my link, it helps support me and it lets Erin Condra know that you love my content and you get a free gift. Like how cute is this free gift? Now, speaking of measuring, I have this Erin Condren ruler. Um, I've seen it a lot on social medias and I wanted to go ahead and check it out because I feel like um, it's a really cute prop and I'm always looking for new cute props that are also functional, like things that I'll actually use, but are cute for social media. So if you are a social media influencer or if you um, are a content creator and you like to post pictures of your desk or of your planner supplies or whatever it is, if you're a teacher, um, or if you want to get a gift for a teacher, this is a really good teacher gift as well. Um, and so I'm pretty sure everyone wants to show some love to those teachers this year, especially considering what's going on right now with schools and how complicated everything is. This is how it looks without the plastic. I'm sorry, it's kind of hard to see what it really looks like. Let me get a piece of paper. There you go. So this makes it a little easier to see what this ruler really looks like. I think it is the cutest thing. Um, you will be seeing it on my social media in photos because it has every color in it, right? Pretty much. And I just think it'll be really cute. It has the Erin Condren logo right here. And I just think it's a really cute gift um, for yourself or for someone else. Next, you know I had to give my petite planning system some love. Um, you all know I love my charms for my petite planner. Every time I do an on-the-go folio revamp, I like to have these. So these are my charms. Um, I got this Druzy charm. It's a, that's what it's called, a Druzy charm. And it is the white color. This is that one. And then I got a letter F. F is my grandmother's name. So I wanted to go ahead and get this. Well, the first initial of her name. Um, and so then I also got a Hello Kitty charm and this charm was sold out for a bit. So I'm super excited about it. I'm going to open this one up just so you can see what it looks like. And this is what the Hello Kitty charm looks like. It is the cutest thing. I'm obsessed. You will see me doing a Hello Kitty video, like a Hello Kitty theme video for my actual on the go folio. And I'm going to dress it up and make it so pretty. I can't wait to show you. Um, I'm going to do like a little Hello Kitty theme week in my planner and I'm gonna do I'm gonna put this charm on the on the go folio so can't wait to do that and then a uh, next for my on the go folio is I bought these adhesive corner pockets they are large sized and I plan to use them in my petite planner so um, this is what the petite planner looks like this is the size of it so just to kind of give you an idea this is how big the pocket is. So I'm gonna try to put it in the on-the-go folio, actually not the planner, but I'm just trying to give you a reference for size. So this will be stuck on the inside of my petite planner. And so I just thought this would be convenient. And it shows you on the back how it looks in the petite planner. And so you can kind of just put like, like it has back here stamps, business cards, stickers, little pieces of paper. So I thought this would be a nice addition to my petite planner system. And I feel like it's the only thing I don't have in my petite planner. I have all the other accessories except for this one. So had to check that out. The next thing I have for my petite planning system is I went ahead and got flower power. I needed some more flower power love. This is the on the go folio sticker album. So you can actually put this in your on the go sticker album and go ahead and check out the videos in my cards because um, I do have some little videos that show the first album and how I plan with it and how I put it in my folio with my folio setup video. So if you wanna see how I use one of these to put in my on-the-go folio, go ahead and click that. And then I have my um, petite journal and this is the productivity layout. So, so if you don't know what the productivity journal looks like, it looks like this, I'll show you the inside. So it has line pages here and then it has a checklist here. So this looks like this all across the board, whether you get a petite planner or a notebook. So if you know someone that would love this layout or you would like it yourself, they do have notebooks as well with the spiral with this same layout or line system. So that is what this one is, but I always make sure I grab a petite planner when they're on sale because I go through them really quickly. I write in them pretty much every day. 
so I go through them fast and then I need more paper so went ahead and got these for my on the go folio and of course I'm gonna make it all you know flower power and beautiful when I put that planner together I'll probably do that in the spring so I wanted to go ahead and grab these and my other um, sticker folio is full with stickers already. So I kind of needed another one. And this is the perfect size for the Erin Condren sticker sticker sheets. Like if you look here, it's the perfect size. So your Erin Condren sticker sheets will fit in here. Next, I had to get an accessory. Y'all know I love my accessories. And I got this mid-century circle pop grip. If this little design looks familiar, it's because it is familiar. I love mid-century circles. Um, this is like a storage box that has it on here. I'm obsessed with this design. So of course I had to go ahead and grab the pop socket. I also have the AirPod case. So if you wanna see the AirPod case, go ahead and click the video in the cards so that you can see the AirPod case. And I will put this on my phone. It'll be kind of hard to show y'all when I do that because I usually record with my phone. But I'll go ahead and um, when I put the little, when I put it on my phone case, I'll show you what it looks like then. Um, probably in my next plan with me. So just wanted to show you this. I thought it was so cute. And then I also went ahead and got another planner. I know what you're thinking. Chloe, you do not need another planner. <laughs> and you would be right. You would be 100% correct. But I try to bring you all different videos and I try to show each person a planner that could work for them. So that is why I do so many different planner reviews here on my channel because I wanna make sure I have something for everyone and give you all a variety. So even though I can't use 10 planners in a year, I do want to show 10 planners and I usually give them away to friends and family members in my life after I review them to you all if I'm not going to use them. But this one I'm going to actually use for 2021. So this one is a horizontal soft bound life, life planner. I wanted to try this out for two reasons. The first reason is because a few years ago I used the horizontal happy planner for journaling and I used it the entire year and I journal in it every week for the whole year. And I really miss that. I have not journaled in a while. And so I miss journaling and getting my thoughts on paper. And so I want to use this for that. And the reason why I'm choosing to use a planner and not a notebook or a journal is because I would like to just not be intimidated with writing a lot. And I just want to write a little bit every day. And um, I am a poet. I do write poetry. So um, I would like to write some very short poems in here. And so I'm just going to use these little lines to write like really short poems or I can like group words together. I can do lettering. I could do a lot of stuff in here. And so that is why I got this planner is because I really want to get back to journaling and mood tracking and just being creative. These are things I probably won't show on social media because it's very personal, but I wanted to get this planner for that reason. So I got this planner for 2021 and I'm excited about it. I love this like look how pretty this is it is so beautiful and i'm gonna do a full review on this on my channel so that is why i'm not doing a full flip through right now because that is going to be a separate video but i just wanted to show you this planner i think it's so beautiful like it is so beautifully crafted like i don't even know how to explain how beautiful it is i feel like it's not coming through on camera but it is a very pretty planner it is rose gold and it is neutral and um with the sale this is like a really great price so I'll put the link in the description below for this planner. It's a really great price. And if you're looking for something portable that doesn't take up a lot of space, this is the perfect size. It actually is the same size almost. I think it is the same size as the petite planner. So if you need a size reference, it's the same size as the petite planner. It's like that A5 size. So it is a great size for people who don't like bulky planners. So I don't know, I'm going on and on, but that's because I love this planner. I think it's really nice. And then I forgot to almost tell you guys that the Hello Kitty um, collection always comes with this little Hello Kitty card that's really cute. And on the back, it just says Hello Kitty Erin Condren. And so you can put this, you can reuse this as a bookmark or whatever you want. So just wanted to put that out there. So now I'm gonna show you my loungewear. It's really hard to show you my loungewear on my desk. So I put together a little cute little TikTok like a video. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert that here so you can see my loungewear in full effect. And then I'm gonna come back and show you my sticker, my little mini sticker haul.
All right, I hope y'all enjoyed that. That was just like a little something, something I put together for social media. If you are not already following me on Instagram, make sure you go check that out because that video actually has a different um, song to it and everything, but I wasn't able to put that on YouTube because I don't want to be flagged. So go ahead and check out my Instagram. That's where I have more content. So check that out. So um, now I'm getting into my stickers. I got them from Mr. and Mrs. Mint Planner Boutique. That is the name of the shop that I ordered these from. They had really fast shipping. I know some shops are small, so they can't get stuff out fast, but this shop gets stuff out really fast. So in opening this up, So this is their little character. This is the cute little bunny, bunny rabbit that they have for their shop. And then when you open it, this is how it comes. This is so cute. So it says, what do you call a sad strawberry, a blueberry? The cute little corny joke there, I love it. And then when you see the second sticker sheet, it has these cute little stickers of the bunny. It has a sweater a bunny with an acorn, popcorn, a little cozy bunny, some socks. It's really cute and there's like the little pumpkins here. So it's still fall, so I'm gonna use these really quickly because I don't wanna have to wait until next year. But I thought they were so cute. Then you have these little fox slippers and you have these cute little autumn themed, um, little autumn themed stickers here. And I love this shop because these are very seasonal, but they're not holiday. This is just cute to me because it's not Halloween, but it is, you know, it is fall and seasonal. So I think that's really cute. And then we have this little freebie here. It says nap time, has this little scalloped sticker, a little desk, a phone, nail, sorry for that, nail polish. So I just think it's a really cute freebie. Like all the freebies she gave me is pretty much like a, another sticker sheet. Um, and then this pumpkin freebie. And I'll put a code in the description below if you want to save 15%. It's not my code, it's someone else's code, but I thought I'd share it here so that they can get the credit. So then I have these stickers and I have this, I got to match my kit. So I'll show you the kit in a second. And then I have this winter bucket list, which I think is so cute. It has drink hot cocoa, snuggle by the fire, go sledding, go read a good book, make homemade soup, go ice skating, go for a nature walk, bake cookies, build a snowman, have a PJ day, get something warm, and movie night marathon. So I thought this was really cute and practical for us kind of being like stuck in the house right now. And so now I'm going to show you these cute little kits. So this says Winter Wonderland, Hello Winter. Um, and it has like to do errands, remember next week. And this just is so cute. I know you can't tell on camera, but the it's very vibrant. Like they might look a little dim on camera, but they're not dim at all. These are very vibrant and colorful stickers. And then for the next, it's, this is my like mini kit. So I want to use this in my petite planner. I'm gonna see if it fits my petite planner well, um, but I, that's what I want to use this for, is for a January kit. So I'll be using these in January and I just thought it was a really pretty um, color scheme. Here is the Mr. and Mrs. Mint washi tape. It has the cute little bunny on it and it is purple and like a pink color and it's hollow. And this is their first washi, I believe. So I had to grab it and it's really cute. So I can't wait to use this in my life planner and my petite planner. So um, getting into this sale again with Erin Condren, make sure you use the link in my description below. The sale is going on still. It'll be on sale until Cyber Monday. Um, and I have a video here explaining how to shop the sale. So go ahead and check out the video in my description um, or in below. I'll put it in the description below, but then I'll also put it in my cards so you can check that video out. And it's a shop with me video. So in that video, I'm shopping with you and showing you everything that I went ahead and put in my cart and some of the things that I've purchased in the past that I recommend. So it's pretty much all of Poetry Plans. Erin Condren recommendations. So this is like a video you must watch if you haven't already. So go ahead and check that out. I appreciate you all tuning in with me this long. I appreciate everyone who watches the ads. Um, I'm monetized now, so I do have some ads and that helps me bring new content. These products are not free. So in order for me to put that money back into YouTube, it helps me when you watch the ads and when you use my links. And I just really appreciate it. If you're not buying anything, but you still wanna support, go ahead and watch these ads and then also click my link 
in the description below anyway even if you're not buying anything clicking my link helps me out because it shows Erin Condren that you like my content so check out Erin Condren check out Mr. and Mrs. Mint um because they have some cute little stickers I'll put their link in the description below as well and I will see you all in the next video Thank you.